Hello, a warm welcome. We've dropped anchor here on the south coast of England at St. Mary Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Southampton versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And here's how it looks for Southampton. James Ward-Prowse starts with Oriol Romeo in the centre of midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. David De Gea between the posts. Marcus Rashford starts with Jadon Sancho out wide. And leading the attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo. Rashford. Ronaldo. Oh, a moment of pure class. Had to catch it perfectly, and didn't he just? Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and the finish is clinical. It just makes it look so easy, doesn't it? So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1 0. A lot of forward thrust here from Ronaldo. Now, what can he do from this excellent position? Rashford. And an astute piece of defending. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. Ronaldo. Mohamed Salisu. Romeo. Che Adams. Not a good pass. Moving the ball forward with purpose. And space to cross it. Bruno Fernandes. Corner kick to United, and an opportunity perhaps for them to make it look even better. Delivering it. And so it will be a corner. Trying to pick out a teammate. Ericsson. On to Sancho. Ronaldo. Not to be this time. Armstrong. 
Oh, they couldn't keep it. Cristiano Ronaldo. Ericsson. And a goal kick given. Ward Prowse. Salisu. Oriol Romeu. Well, that ball looks promising. Now, can they create something? And the keeper more than equal to the task. Malasia. So nearly at half time, and the home side trailing, albeit not by much. Stuart, your thoughts up to this point? Well, I've been a little disappointed with their attacking play. It's all been a bit too slow. If they can pass it into their front areas with more quality, switch play quicker, and be more positive in 1v1 situations, I think they'll get back into this. And they could really get at the opposition. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. Ericsson. And with that, the first half draws to a close. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he shot... The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Romain Perrault. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. Losing possession here. Throw-ins given. Elianusi. Careless once more in possession of the ball. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Cristiano Ronaldo. Now Casemiro. Here's Ronaldo. Keeping it moving dynamically. Oh, surely. They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. But when he shoots, I expect him to go across the goalkeeper. He should never beat the goalkeeper inside that near post. That's not good keeping. Bednarek Oriol Romeu Elianusi Jay Adams sends it back in position now and it goes to reduce the deficit still very much alive and kicking Well, here's the goal again, and you have to say the patience of the passing is outstanding. They're just waiting for the right time to penetrate, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. Both substitutes have been getting ready will come on at the same time. Go for 
So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Spraying passes around, almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake. Casemiro. Ericsson. Jaden Sancho. Maguire. Lisandro Martinez. Harry Maguire now. Ericsson. Bruno Fernandes. Well, is it going to end up being productive for them? Ericsson. What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal. Well, here it is again. The build-up is so patient. They're just waiting to play that killer pass at the right time. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Well, it's a tale of four goals in this match now. Three, one it is. With the owner of the blue card registration, BG04DOM. Romain Perrault. Stuart Armstrong. And they find a gap in the defence. Well, he's lost it. Well, he strayed offside just as it looked promising. Redmond, Jay Adams, well read to ease the pressure. Romain Perrault, Redmond, Romeu, chance to cross. And there to intervene. Now a decent position. Romeu. Romeu. Oh, a vital interception. Well, visionary passing. Well, it was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Will he find the net? In it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all. Well, just look at how poor the defending is here. But I have to say, it's still a very tidy finish. He looked really assured there. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Armstrong. Redmond. Romeu. Stuart Armstrong. And there goes the final whistle. Disappointing for Southampton, whatever way you look at it, a defeat here. You're absolutely right, Derek. While the result is poor, the display was even worse. They never got to grips with the opposition. They were second best in every facet of the game. They need to do a lot of improving before the next time out. Well, good luck to any defender trying to stop Marcus Rashford. And they haven't had too much luck on that front, Stuart.
Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.